Hello and welcome to Sword War Gaming and another Bolt Action unboxing. Now we've been focusing mainly on the Soviet forces in previous videos, what with the Ostfront Theatre book, the Soviet Winter Infantry and also the Naval Brigade Sailors as well. So we're going to be focusing on the German squad in this video, notably the German Veteran Grenadier Squad. Now towards the end of the war, um, the German forces were kind of trying to kind of tip the balance back in their favour and so they started to create form squads that were armed with some better weaponry, no notably the MP44 SG44. So as a result this entire squad is armed with uh, the heavier assault rifles compared to like the submachine gun and rifle seen in early in the war. So let's uh, open up the squad and have a look at the contents. I've zoomed in on the miniatures in order for us to get a closer look at the detailing and um, as you can see, it's quite nicely uh, defined, such as like the, the fabric, especially on the ponchos here. Um, you've got like, the nice creases in the shoulders there as well. Comes in a range of different poses. Uh, you've got a few guys who are just kind of uh, signalling to halt, and we also get this guy here who's carrying a pair of binoculars. Now, one of the things you may have noticed is that none of these guys actually have any heads, and they call these this uh, separate sprue here. So you can kind of mix and match what you want. This one is entirely consisting of uh, heads with foliage in there, and there is also another one which comes with a, a few guys who are wearing the caps as well. So there's just enough uh, heads there to use to kind of give it all your squad members uh, a head. However, it's not really mentioned on the box, but you can actually just, the fact that these are separate, which is nice because you can actually uh, mix and match these between your other squads, kind of creates a little bit more character or a little bit more variety between them. So you could use some of these like foliage caps on like a standard infantry squad, or if you wanted to make like a veteran squad from uh, a normal uh, the German infantry sprue, then you could do that as well. Um, not much in the way of mold lines to remove, you've just got a little bit of flashing on these, well obviously with them being metal that's expected, quite easy to remove, just a matter of kind of twisting it off and it's done. Um, the range of poses is also nice as well, they're all kind of quite distinctive and there's also slight variations in the uniforms as well, so you're not getting too much repetition across the 10 men squad there. So uh, that was the um, the German Veteran Grenadier Squad. Let's zoom out and kind of get some overall summary of them. So overall a well detailed, uh, well sculpted squad. Um, I particularly like this uh, German Veteran Grenadier Squad because, mainly because they actually kind of stand out from your run of the mill infantry just like the Wehrmacht, mainly because they are wearing their uh, ponchos and they also have the heavier uh, MP44s as well. So nice looking squad, nicely detailed. I also like the little details such as kind of foliage in the, uh, the helmets as kind of depicted on the front here as well. So that was another Bolt Action unboxing. Uh, these seem to be going down quite well, so I'll continue to do some more. So let me know in the comments if there's any particular unit you would like to see in any future unboxings, or if there's any tutorials for particular painting guides or anything else like that. So as always, thanks for watching and goodbye.